Welcome everyone to our 33 day consecration to St. Joseph, day 31. By the sign of the cross, deliver us from our enemies, you who are our God. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Him. De Joseph celebrate of me no cheli tu. Te cuntire sone in Christi adum cori. Qui clarus meritis iuntus es in Christi. Casto federe fircini. Almo cum tu mitam germine coniuge, admirans dubio tangeris ansius, afatu superi flaminis angelus. Conceptum puerum doce. Tu natum dominum stringis ad exteras. Egepti profugum tu sequeris plagas. Amisum solimis queris et invenis. Nicens gaudia fletibus. Electos reliquos mors pia consecrat. Amam que meritos gloria suscipit, tu viven superis par fueris Deo. Mira sorte beatio. Nobisum at fias pace precantibus. Da Iosef meritis ideras cambere. Utandem liceat nos tibi perpetim. Gratum pro mere canticum. Amen. Let us pray to the Holy Spirit for guidance. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of thy faithful and enkindle in them the fire of thy love. Send forth thy spirit, and they shall be created, and thou shalt renew the face of the earth. Let us pray. O God, who didst instruct the hearts of the faithful by the light of the Holy Spirit, grant us in the same spirit to be truly wise, and ever to rejoice in his consolation. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer of the Holy Clock Novena. O glorious patriarch, Saint Joseph, you who were chosen by God above all others to be the earthly head of the Holy Family, I ask you to accept us within the folds of your holy cloak, that you may be the guardian and protector of our souls, of our families, parish and world. From this moment on, we choose you as our father, protector, help, and patron. And we ask you to place us in your care, our health and well being, our faith, our lives, and our deaths. Look upon us as one of your children, defend us from all harm and from our enemies, invisible or otherwise. Assist us always in all our necessities. 
console us in the bitterness of life, and especially at the hours of our deaths. Say but one word for us to the divine savior, you who are worthy to hold in your arms and to marry your spouse. Ask please for those blessings that will lead us to Jesus. Include us among those who are dear to you and we shall try to prove ourselves worthy of all we know you will do. Amen. Meditation. Day 31, Powerful Intercessor. Over the last 30 days, we have reflected on various aspects of St. Joseph's life. Hopefully, you have gotten to know him and have been inspired by his life. We have invoked his intercession for a wide variety of needs. Today, we simply ask him to be our intercessor. And as first step toward Consecration Day, we offer this prayer to entrust ourselves to his fatherly care. Dear St. Joseph, after Mary, you are the most powerful intercessor before God. In a sense, Jesus remains obedient to you and will listen to you as you bring our intentions to him. Because of this, we especially want to entrust ourselves entrust to you all of our needs and cares, trusting that you will bring them with Mary to your son Jesus. Dear Saint Joseph, as the best of fathers, as the one that God chose to be the virginal father of Jesus, we believe that you know what we need better than what we do ourselves. So go ahead Saint Joseph, we give you permission to care for us as your children. In doing so, we trust that you will do everything in your power to make our life into something beautiful for God. We trust that you will watch over us and that your prayers will guide us, bless us and protect us. We trust that you will now care for us with the same love and tenderness with which you cared for Jesus. And we will confirm this special relationship with you when we make our prayer of consecration. St. Joseph, powerful intercessor, please pray for us and all our intentions. Amen. We now pray the litany of St. Joseph. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us. Christ, hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. Christ, graciously hear us. God, the Father in heaven, have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Holy Mary, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Renowned offspring of David, pray for us. Light of patriarchs, pray for us. Spouse of the Mother of God, pray for us. Praise Guardian of the Virgin, pray for us. Foster, Father of the Son of God, pray for us. Diligent Protector of Christ, pray for us. Head of the Holy Family, pray for us. Joseph, Most Just, pray for us. Joseph, Most Taste, pray for us. Joseph, most prudent, pray for us. Joseph, most strong, pray for us. Joseph, most obedient, pray for us. Joseph, most faithful, pray for us. 
mirror of patience. Pray for us. Lover of poverty. Pray for us. Model of artisans. Pray for us. Glory of home life. Pray for us. Guardian of a virgins. Pray for us. Pillar of families. Pray for us. Solace of the wretched. Pray for us. Hope of the sick. Pray for us. Patron of the time. Pray for us. Terror of demons. Pray for us. Protector of Holy Church. Pray for us. Lamp of God who takes away the sins of the world. Spare us, O Lord. Lamp of God who takes away the sins of the world. Graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. He made him the Lord of his house. And ruler over all his possessions. Let us pray. O God, in your ineffable providence, you were pleased to choose blessed Joseph to be the spouse of your most holy mother. Grant, we beg you, that we may be worthy to have him for our intercessor in heaven, whom on earth we venerate as our protector. You who live and reign forever and ever. Saint Amen. Joseph, pray for us. Daily challenge. Take some time today to list your personal intentions that come to mind, ending with the words, and for all the other intentions in my heart, St. Joseph, I bring to you in my consecration. Consecration. St. Joseph, called to be the father of Jesus, and united to the spiritual motherhood of Mary through God's love. You now are also our Father. To you, we consecrate our life and the mission that God has entrusted to us. We ask you to intercede for us before the Lord, to intercede for the salvation of the Holy Church, to intercede in our prayers and lift them up to God. Saint Joseph, chaste, just, prudent, and humble husband of Mary. Make your glorious virtues emerge in our spirit and in the world for the glory of God. Make us sweet, docile, tender, and meek with our neighbor and especially with our family, not from our weakness, but through God's strength. Let him who is all powerful be in us and us in him. Beloved Saint Joseph, you are present, but only the divine spirit remains in you as you recede into the silence of love. Show us how to humble ourselves in that way. Pray that in the presence of the Holy Spirit, we may recognize that without God, we are nothing and we can do nothing. Pray that God may work in our hearts as in yours. Pray that our pettiness may disappear and your greatness may appear, recognizing our weakness in the presence of his love. By Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Novena Prayer Saint Joseph, you are the faithful protector and intercessor of all who love and venerate you. You know that we have confidence in you and that after Jesus and Mary, we come to you as an example for holiness, for you are especially close with God. Therefore, we humbly commend ourselves with all you are dear to us and all that belong to us to your intercession. We beg of you by your love for Jesus and Mary, 
not to abandon us during life and to assist us at the hour of our death. Glorious Saint Joseph, spouse of the Immaculate Virgin, pray for us to have a pure, humble, charitable mind and perfect resignation to the divine will. Be our guide, our father, and our model through life that we may die as you did in the arms of Jesus and Mary. Loving Saint Joseph, faithful follower of Jesus Christ, we raise our hearts to you to implore your powerful intercession in obtaining from the divine heart of Jesus all the graces necessary for our spiritual and temporal welfare, particularly the grace of a happy death and the special grace we now implore. Guardian of the Word Incarnate, we feel confident that your prayers on our behalf will be graciously heard before the throne of God. Saint Joseph, most just, pray for us. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Prayer for protection. O Saint Joseph, whose protection is so great, so strong, so prompt before the throne of God, we place in you all our interests and desires. O Saint Joseph, do assist us by your powerful intercession and obtain for us from your divine Son all spiritual blessings through Jesus Christ our Lord so that having engaged here below your heavenly power, we may offer our thanksgiving and homage to the most loving of fathers. O Saint Joseph, we never weary contemplating you and Jesus asleep in your arms. We dare not approach while he reposes near your heart. Press him in our names and kiss his fine head for us and ask him to return the kiss when we draw our dying breaths. Saint Joseph, patron of departed souls, pray for us. Amen. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins and bring us to life everlasting. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, amen. We have concluded our 33-day consecration to St. Joseph, day 31, and we look forward to praying it together with you again at the same time tomorrow. God bless you, St. Joseph. Pray for us.